In today's video, we will discuss the 10 twisted horror movies ever made. Before we get started, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and thank you for watching. At number 10 we have, Possum is about a disgraced children's puppeteer, Philip Connell, who returns to his childhood home and is forced to confront his past trauma. Haunted by a horrific spider-like marionette named Possum that he carries in a leather duffel bag, Philip repeatedly tries to dispose of it, but it inexplicably returns each time. Does he seek or does he hide? Can you spy him deep within? Little Possum. The film is a psychological horror, devoid of typical jump scares, and instead, it instills a sense of permanent dread. Possum's twisted nature lies in its unsettling atmosphere, disturbing imagery, and exploration of psychological themes like guilt and trauma. Caveat. You really made a mess of this. At number 9 we have, Caveat is about Isaac, a drifter suffering from partial memory loss who accepts a job to look after a psychologically disturbed woman in a secluded house on an island. The job requires Isaac to be chained in a harness that restricts him to certain parts of the house. He experiences supernatural phenomena and discovers a corpse hidden in the basement. Do you think he's gonna let you leave her? Director Damon McCarthy nails it with a tense atmosphere, unexpected twists, and characters that'll give you the shivers. The Platform Tiene buen corazón. No creo que sobrevino usted mucho tiempo. At number 8 we have The Platform. This gripping sci-fi thriller is set in a vertical prison where inmates are housed in stacked cells, each containing a platform of food that descends through the levels. The plot follows Goring, a new prisoner, as he navigates the harsh reality of this dystopian system. Each day, the platform starts filled with delicious dishes, but as it descends, the lower levels receive only the remnants, leading to a struggle for survival. <laughs> The movie masterfully explores themes of social hierarchy, greed, and the consequences of unchecked power. Vivarium It's a boy. At number 7 we have Vivarium follows a young couple searching for their dream home who end up trapped in a strange suburban neighborhood with identical houses. No matter how hard they try to escape, they always return to the same spot. They're forced to raise a rapidly growing, otherworldly child. The child mimics them and screams when hungry. The couple's attempts to escape prove futile, leading to a life of monotonous despair. Vivarium is a gripping tale of suspense and surrealism that will leave you questioning reality. Us. Be careful. <laughs> At number 6 we have the movie Us directed by Jordan Peele. The film follows the Wilson family, who encounter airy doppelgangers of themselves while on vacation. These malevolent lookalikes known as the Tethered, harbor a dark and haunting secret. <laughs> Initiating a night of terror and survival as the family fights to overcome these sinister versions of themselves. Absentia. Question you a lot more. I swear to you, I could hear him in the walls. <laughs> At number 5 we have, Absentia is about Trisha, a pregnant woman who is ready to declare her missing husband, Daniel, dead after 7 years. As she prepares for this, her sister Kali comes to stay with her and becomes drawn to a mysterious tunnel near the house. The tunnel is linked to a series of disappearances, including Daniel's. Taken away by a monster. It's sleeping. I 
I saw it. Hallucinate. When Daniel suddenly reappears, he is malnourished, dehydrated, and can only explain that he was underneath. As they dig deeper into the tunnel mystery, Trisha and Kali find themselves facing eerie secrets and strange forces they can understand. Orphan First Kill The mother protects her family. At number four we have Orphan. First Kill is a sequel of 2009 movie Orphan. is about Lena Klammer, a 31-year-old woman with a rare hormonal disorder that gives her the appearance of a nine-year-old child. After escaping from an Estonian psychiatric facility, she travels to America by impersonating Esther, the missing daughter of a wealthy family. Hello, mommy. Thank you, mommy. <laughs> However, her disguise starts to slip, leading to a confrontation with a mother who will protect her family from the murderous child at any cost. The visit. Is that? <sighs> Mom, you need to come right now. <laughs> at number three, we have the visit is about two siblings, Becca and Tyler who go to stay with their estranged grandparents. During their visit, they notice their grandparents behaving bizarrely and decide to document their experiences. The grandparents' strange behavior intensifies over time, leading to a series of disturbing discoveries. I'm sad, it's all over. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. It's a chilling tale of suspense and horror as the siblings struggle to escape the terrifying truth lurking within their grandparents' house. Lake Mungo. At number two we have, Lake Mungo is about a 16-year-old girl, Alice Palmer, who drowns while swimming with her family at a dam in Australia. After her death, her family experiences a series of strange and inexplicable events centered around their home. Alice's brother sets up video cameras around the house, capturing what seem to be images of Alice's ghost. Something bad is going to happen to me. I feel like something bad has happened. It hasn't reached me yet, but it's on its own. The family seeks the help of a psychic and parapsychologist, Ray Kemeny. A series of clues lead the family to Lake Mungo, where Alice's secret past emerges. Kill List At number one of our list is Kill List, follows an ex-soldier turned contract killer who takes on a new assignment with his partner as they delve deeper into their mission. They uncover a dark and disturbing underworld filled with violence and ritualistic killings. Soon, they find themselves trapped in a web of conspiracy and danger, where they must confront their own demons to survive. They're bad people. They should suffer. Kill List is a gripping thriller that keeps viewers on the edge of their seats until the very end. That's it guys. If you like this video, kindly give it a thumbs up make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.